Hey guys, and welcome back to another Factorio workshop video. As always, I am joined by Mad Zuri. Hello. And uh, today we're going over some belt balancers, some in to in uh, count perfect uh, belt balancers submitted by uh, Source C uh, DK or Sork DK. I'm sorry if I mispronounce that, but um, he submitted some 8 to 8, 16 to 16, and 32 to 32 uh, throughput into in balancers, which is pretty cool. We haven't actually really gone over these much. And, uh, and yeah, so I'll kind of let Zuri cover this stuff because he's a lot more experienced with this than I am. Uh, but so we have an 8 to 8 here, and this is the only one we're actually testing live just because these others are, uh, I mean, they're quite huge and stuff. It would be a bit of a an annoyance to, to test them, and if this one works, then I'm sure these other works work as well. But, but yeah, I'll kind of let Zuri take over and just you know explain you know why it works or if it does or doesn't work. Well, typically I'd call these a Boolean balancer. There are numbers of Boolean, you know, two, four, eight, sixteen, thirty-two. Right. Okay. And a lot of these go off of a I'm gonna call them a fractal composition. You start with the two balancer, which is just a splitter. You make a four balancer. You use enough of those to build an eight balancer. You use enough eight balancers to make a 16 balancer. Uh, so on and so forth. Right. So, um, well, I mean, to, so what we're demonstrating here, right, is we're inputting four belts um, up here, and then we're outputting four belts. Uh, but you'll notice, you know, they're obviously uh, different uh, four belts. You know, this is just the top four. This is the two in the middle here and here. Um, but they are fully compressed and balanced, uh, which demonstrates that this is working. And you can see all the lanes are moving, uh, which is kind of the point of these, is that, you know, it's balancing between all eight lanes, even though you're only inputting and outputting four. And, uh, and so th there is a difference, right, that we were kind of talking about, that there is, um, like, count perfect and then count to count perfect, where... Um, your input is balanced and then your count to count means that like your input and output are balanced um yeah so usually a count perfect you'll, you'll have four inputs or so and then you'll have four outputs and they'll be balanced and they'll be about half a belt each but if you block half of the belts instead of pushing all of the rest down the remaining lanes it'll still only put half a belt. Let me see if I can demonstrate that. Okay. Yep, here we go, already. So the one on the left is not, it, it is count perfect, but it's not count to count or both input and output. It's one or the other. And usually you fix this by putting two together. And that usually solves the problem, which is exactly what they did for the 16 bell. This is the count perfect, and this one's a count to count perfect. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, very, a very good explanation there. So this is just literally just two of these uh, stuck together. Um, you know, exactly as Zuri said, you know, because this one, uh, if you just have one, it balances the inputs and stuff, but you can see that now it's only outputting half. Uh, but then when you throw on a second one, it balances those again and actually outputs a balanced even number on the end, which is what makes it count to count. So, uh, so yeah, then the 16 is, uh, I mean, this is just, again, the normal 16, which is just count perfect, um, and then the count to count perfect. So if you want it, like all balanced you would just throw two of these together which is what this is and uh then we have this monster which uh is a 32 to 32 um i believe count to count perfect yeah i didn't want to take the time to test it we'll assume that it's been properly tested yeah and it looks like it's missing a few things like these belts in here i assume need to be connected i'm sure it was just a an error probably just easily just replace these right but i mean like you would want these connected right or just gone 
it should be connected as far as I can tell. Yeah, I mean, it, it might have been a blueprint thing. Sometimes blueprints are kind of finicky with like stuff like that. So, I mean, this thing's huge, but really it almost needs to be this big. You can make it a little more compact, which we'll show down below one Ziri did quite a while ago. Um, and I know this looks gigantic and it is, but really it almost needs to be for, for, for this. I'll call this a pretty standard size for this sort of balancer that's count to count perfect. Yeah. Yeah. So, I mean, you know, you're, you're inputting 32 lanes of stuff and you're outputting a balanced 32 lanes of stuff or, or however much, um, you know, it could work the, the same way, right? Like if you, if you only inputted say eight belts, um, then theoretically this should output 32 belts like evenly from those eight, if that's what you want. Or any belts fully compressed if the rest of the belts are uh, backfilled or can't move. Yeah, that too. So, so um, shall we show them my version I built uh, a year ago? Yeah, so this is Zuri's version, um, which unsurprisingly is just like insanely good. <laughs> I mean, this is a this is a count to count thirty two to thirty two. Um, so just a count perfect is actually half of this. Um, we've stuck two of them together to get the count to count. And uh, it's far more compact. But I mean, again, this is definitely a standard size. Like this isn't like, like overbuilt necessarily. Zuri's just happens to be like insanely compact. I do it again. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's a Zuri build, so it's not that surprising. Um, but yes, yeah, so you built this like a year ago, right? Wow. So, uh, so yeah, I mean, it, it's the same thing. I mean, 30, uh, we have, you know, 4, 8, uh, whatever, 12, 16, and then the double that. So 32 to 32. And, um, and I mean, really, that should, this, I mean, this is just kind of for a, a, a variant build if you want. You know, we're not, this one is more compact, but, they both are very good, and uh, and the blueprints for all of this will be in the description for the 8 to 8, 16 to 16, 32 to 32, and uh, I guess maybe Zuri 32 to 32 if you want to share that. I don't know if you shared it already or if sure, you want if you to. want. Yeah. So, uh, really, I think that's it, unless you have any uh, other notes or comments about the Zuri. I know you mentioned briefly that just like the reason you have to do two of them together to get count to count is just because of a, like a funny way splitters work. Also a funny way math works. I'd rather not get too far into detail into that. But yeah, if you have a certain number of lanes input and have a certain number of lanes backed up on the output, you're going to need two just count perfect builds to make it count to count perfect. Right. Sounds good. So, uh, so there you go, guys. Uh, you know, we haven't really covered necessarily things like this before, so I hope you can find them helpful. I definitely did, you know, because I, uh, I, I just don't know how to make this kind of stuff, so it's great to have uh, blueprints and references. But I think that'll do it for this one. Again, blueprints in the description if you want to check them out and grab them and test them and use them. And any more submissions you have would be fantastic as well down in the comments. But until next time, we will catch you later. Later.